Okay, so before we start this video, I just wanted to make it clear there was a problem with the stream, which is why you're seeing the first battle being in the middle of Mandalia Plains, uh, which is like the third battle in the game. Uh, so, sorry about that, but with that, this is my introduction for my Final Fantasy Tactics 1.3 Insane Difficulty mod uh, playthrough. If you are interested in SRPGs or you just like the series as a whole, I really recommend you guys trying this out because uh, it makes the game way more fun and way more challenging uh, than it's ever been. So with that, uh, enjoy the video and please stick around for more to come. Alright, there we go. Now the stream is working. So, jumping right in. Mandalia Plains. Let's get it done. Got Ziggy the Squire. And... God, all, no, not double shot. Okay, good. I think all these guys have fucking crossbows. Which, by the way, is for goddamn ridiculous. Come on, Delita. Don't. No, you're dead. That is basically a death sentence right there. Hmm. I believe that is too far for a crossbow. Nope, that's perfect. Although, knowing him, he's got weapon guard and it's gonna be impossible to hit. No, he doesn't. Or he does, but he's not impossible to hit. Double shot. Damn it. Alright, and then... This might be a dumb idea, but I want to counteract his... slow by giving him haste, and then hopefully I can heal him Oh, what a dev- yeah. Voodoo is ridiculous. I fucking hate that ability. Will this counteract poison? No? Alright. Or maybe I just actually missed. There, that counteracts slow. And she's not gonna be able to get anywhere near to give him a potion, unfortunately. Hopefully he doesn't eat 20 more arrows. Keyword is if I didn't miss. Block. Alright. You have been fine with a regular potion, asshole. Using all my shit. I wonder if um, he must automatically equip himself with whatever you have in your inventory because last time he had a crossbow, I believe. Oh, there's one down. That is rather unfortunate. And then there's another slow poison. really want to take that Toonberry out. He's gonna cripple my team. No. Yeah, I probably should. Oh, you just have random gear? Okay. Yeah. 
Okay, the hope is that Ramza goes before the dead guy. No. Yeah, going for the Toonberry action might fuck me over, just giving him more turns to slow everyone. Alright, please, not a lot. There we go, perfect. I can just use the five pain. Let's get to back here. Oh, the other option is keeping him at low. Because she will go next. She can heal him. And yeah. We'll do that. And she will act as an arrow shield. God damn it, of course. God damn it, Delita. I feel like uh, RNG is purposely against you in this mod. I've never missed so many 85%, 90%. And I've also never seen these motherfuckers dodge so many 95s. Yeah, 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 you died. You must say the Marquis. So sad. This time I won't waste a turn. It's good to know that Thief obviously doesn't have an item. Yes! Oh, that was helpful. Come on, kitchen knife to leave it. No. <sighs> I really want to start working on the tune berry. Cheer no, well, Blade says I have cheer out. So we can drop the poison. Yay! Yeah, it's true. It never did matter. Block! Or take ridiculous amounts of damage. That works too. Damn, can the brother get the dodge or something? You fucking asshole! I cannot believe you had a back shot, an open back shot, and you're like, nope! I'm gonna throw a stone. That is obviously the best option. Uh, speaking of best option... 72... Is this Ziggy? Yeah, it doesn't matter. I don't think players can get in range to actually kill him. Which means I'm the one who has to do it. That 
that's how you fucking throw a stone, bruh. Pro stone, MLG. Alright. Double shot, please. No? Okay. Alright, starting to get control of this battle. A miss here would be super nice. What's his sign? Eh, whatever. That's the one I want to go for. Wait. No. I'd like to take out that thief. Maybe make my way to Algus and get his ass up. Damn it! God, really? Oh, fuck you, RNG. Oh, good God. Good God. Thank you. Finally, some fucking luck. Alright. Let's see. This turn's probably gonna be one that really matters. I wanna start working on him. I also wanna get her up, but if I get her up, he's just gonna kill her. Please tell me he goes before the fucking Toonberry. Is Arches the name of the Toonberry? Yep, so he's dead. <sighs> hmm. What's August at? Yeah. Alright. I think my best play is just to get her up. And then if she dies, she dies. But she might have a higher speed, or I might get fucking lucky with something. Oh my god! Yes! Block! Block! Yes! Oh, thank you! Jesus Christ, thank you. I don't think they can do 30 damage to me. I'm really worried about... Oh, I guess he won't stone anytime soon. Alright, I'll move here so I can get... No. He's an archer, right? If I move here, he's gotta move towards my team. So we're gonna do that. Fucking target. one of the new squire skills in this game. Alright, I guess he doesn't have to move towards my team. Oh, you crafty bastard. Miss. Miss, please. Please miss. Damn it. Alright. Damn it, she missed her turn again. He'll have a turn soon for the thief. Most likely, but he probably will heal himself. Can't let that thief get up. No RNG for you. Now what I could do is Oh, he's got a dagger? Alright, 
right. Pretty sure he can still get to her. But I'm gonna take that risk. God damn it, of course he's still gonna get to her. He's got battle boots. Or move plus one. Yes! Finally! Woo! So always happens with me with target is that motherfucker decides, you know what, I'm gonna do half the damage I say I'm gonna do. Which is cool. That's RNG, so. Oh, Keith. Really wanted your crystal. Luck! Sixty, sixty. Oh, he might actually outspeed Ramza. Uh, yeah, I'm worried I wouldn't be able to hit him at that angle. I might hit Ramza. Save scum it. Ooh, leather hat. Perfect. Ninety percent too, yeah. Yes, all right. I really need to start killing that tune, Mary. 42, 93. Let's do that then. Now here's what I'm worried about is Ramza is gonna die. No, they have fucking they have shields. Or they can dodge me. Shut up! Block that shit! You got weapon guard? You got knife? It's me out of Mithril. Yes! Alright, get your revenge. Your sweet, sweet chemist revenge. Alright. Straight up execution style. Fuck you. not drop crystals in this one? Do something where you don't get hit. Thank you. See? It does work. <laughs> I just have to clarify a little better. I guess you're right. You know what? You're in the perfect spot. Just, uh... They just won't. And save some CT... You're gonna move back to how much HP do you have? Yeah, we're not gonna risk it. Not for a fucking treasure chest. I do want to make sure he can't get a crystal though. Although that's not really gonna stop, he can just probably walk around. Fuck you, Toonberry! Alright. Whew! Really bothers me how retardedly difficult, or probably should say retardedly, how difficult it is to actually be successful on the first mission of this game. Does he have counter? Oh no, he has CT save. Can, right? Yeah, I thought so. Oh, really? Alright. So 
Super Rock. Eh, at least he didn't see T save. Could really use a Squire Crystal. Oh, you dick. You're not gonna hit, though. Uh, or, or you're gonna hit. Does he have monster skill? Nope. Toonberry was just holding on to that one that whole time. Alright. I don't want him to get that crystal. He's gonna be my archer, and those are exactly what I wanted. Um, nice. Well done. That's all I want. Do I even want to waste a Phoenix Town at this point? That's what everyone... Okay. That makes sense. So it was just explained to me that the everyone's grudge does damage based on missing HP. Which is why he wouldn't have been using it on things that have... Um... Or he wouldn't be using it because he didn't have any HP missing. Because I purposely wasn't... I knew there was a reason why I wasn't going for Toon Berries. Oh, you dick. He just rezzed her. Now he's gonna waste another Phoenix down. Motherfuck. Of course. Fuck it. No, it could be Battle Boots or something. Alright, I will get Rams up. Yeah, right? I like when they're low HP, he's just like, he looks like a depressed kid who wants to go play in the snow, but his parents won't let him until he's like done eating. He's like, man, this is bogus, mom. Hmm. You know what? Fuck you, Toonberry. <laughs> Don't kill the fucking- God damn it! Don't take damage! Yes! That'll work. Oh, of course. Super glad I prolonged this fight so I could get a leather fucking hat. Alright, Delita. Make it happen. Whew! Good god. And that is the first mission of this game. That 
was about 25 minutes. So we're going to go ahead and stop it here. That's chapter one. Now, now that I think about it, this might not really be conducive to YouTube considering how many videos it would actually be. Maybe I'll just skip all the grinding and just do story missions. Yeah, yeah, you're Algus, you're great. I see I have a third person in chat. Yeah, Orvin doesn't count. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, um, when I started this playthrough, I literally just put everyone on auto and just went back to like editing the um, the Twitch screen and working on my YouTube intro and just waiting for it to finish. Garland doesn't count though. That shit's super- I think you can't lose Garland. But then again, I would think you couldn't lose this mission either, and obviously I was proven wrong last time. But I mean, Garland, you just, they're not, they all suck. They all have, like, daggers, and they're throwing potions at walls and shit. Yes. Now I have Wish. And counter -th Yeah, kind of though. He's gonna be a monk. He'll have item until he changes to monk. The question is, is, did they get job level ups? No, they did not. Oh, I guess you have to be level 3 in those jobs now. Yeah, you do get 2 faith for, um... Or maybe not. How did they get the extra faith? They weren't at 72. Huh. Interesting. Alright, so I'm going to stop it here. I'll restart the stream in about five minutes. i got some things I need to take care of. Uh, thanks for sticking around, and I will see you guys in the next video.